Tonight, some of our neighbors in Seminole County making their case against a road proposal. They say the plan to ease congestion could make living here a lot more complicated. Now, to get you up to speed, leaders want to extend Slavia Road in Oviedo to the east. The red line you see on your screen indicates where the new four-lane road would be laid. The idea is to give drivers on Chapman and Mitchell Hammock Roads another option. But if you look closely, parts of the plan cuts through some neighborhoods. News 6's Troy Campbell is live in Oviedo tonight where people, people impacted made their voices heard at a special meeting. Troy. Yeah, people who live in this neighborhood tell us that they're concerned having this roadway be extended all the way through to Aloma on the other side. However, one thing both residents and county officials agree on is something must be done to help ease traffic. As these were built, you know, we had some, some flooding issues. Brick Baker says she's lived near Slavia Road in Oviedo for more than 20 years. She says each time a new subdivision is built, she experiences more flooding near her property. The things that I've noticed is when I'm driving and I'm watching the traffic, most of the traffic is still traveling further east or it's going north on Alafaya. So putting another roadway in, I don't know that that's really going to do much besides affect all of us. Seminole County held a public meeting inside the Oviedo Mall on Tuesday evening, but several property owners say they still haven't been able to ask their questions in person. Pre-made presentation that was very brief and just basically went over all the information that's already been available publicly. Uh, they did not take questions and answers afterwards, which I think we all fully expected, which is why we showed up. Seminole County says it's initiated a traffic study for alternative routes to travel between Aloma Avenue and Alafaya Trail to alleviate traffic congestion. The potential routes include extending Slavia Road where the road currently ends, adding a route through the Mitchell Creek neighborhood connecting to Alafaya Trail, and creating a route north of both the Cooper Chase and Mitchell Creek neighborhoods. Officials say it could be more than a year before a decision is made. We want to get the public's input. We want to do the best thing for everybody. And, uh, and this is how we do it. We invite the public. We get their comments and their feedback. And, and we see how to move forward from there. And county officials say it would still be at least a year before one of the three routes are selected, adding that there's processes that will take more time, including some of those plans, which would require them to buy private property from some of these homeowners to make it a public right of way. Live in Oviedo tonight, Troy Campbell getting results news six.